we know your story and the hardships and that you have to endure to get to this point, not only in your career, but personally at such a young age. Um, so we want to know how fast you needed to mature to deal with everything that was going on around you with your life and try, trying to carry a successful career as you have so far. Um, yeah, you know, I think just like a lot of people who go through certain things, you know, it um, makes you grow up. It makes you more mature. It makes you, uh, you know, gives you a stronger mentality and a different perspective. So, you know, I think that those things have, uh, you know, difficult times, you know, make strong people. And, you know, that doesn't go for just me. There's a lot of people out there who, you know, it's done the same thing for. So we, we've thought, we spoke a couple of times. Uh, the first year was around that Mike Lee fight. After that, you got married to Jordan and uh, whom you celebrated just your three year anniversary. Congratulations for that. Um, so how important has she been in, in your process of growth and leading that life change until now? Um, it's been good. You know, she's definitely played um, an important role. You know, she's definitely helped me grow. It's been, you know, a great time. And um, so it's been good. <laughs> she's obviously very involved in the sports and she might know a, a couple of things about your craft. Um, yeah. In a conversation before this was confirmed, Jordan seemed very supportive of a fight versus Canelo. What kind of conversations have you guys uh, both had about this fight? Um, we've had some conversations and, um, you know, Jordan, she knows a lot about boxing. She's in the gym every day with me, my sparring, my track workouts, you know, my miles, strength and condition, whatever it may be. And, you know, she's been around this sport a lot and um, she studies the sport. So she knows a lot about it. And, um, you know, we're supremely confident going into November 6th. She knows what I need to do. I know what I need to do. And now it's just about, you know, letting that bell ring and going in there and doing what I got to do. So. Any any advices from her? Any anything? I don't know. Maybe pointer. Anything in particular that might stand out in your mind while you talk to her? No, no, no. She she knows I know what I need to do, and um, you know her support is is enough. So, what was her reaction to what happened in that first presser when uh, when in which you and Canelo got really physical at it? What what do you guys talk about that? Mm, nothing much. I mean. You know, people keep asking about that, but it's like, you know, there's been so many times that that's happened in boxing before, and there's going to be so many times that that happens in boxing moving forward. It's just part of boxing, and um, people don't have to understand it. They don't have to like it, but sometimes tempers are going to flare, especially when there's a lot on the line. So, um, you know, it's just a scuffle. It's not, it's not a big deal.